Welcome back everyone to another video and in this one we will be taking a quick look at disabling the GUI uh, on Debian running on any of your 96 boards. So for this example I am using uh, the Dragon Board 410C which is running 17.09 build of Debian and uh, this pretty much works for any system that uses a system D uh, in it and so as you can see I am booted into uh, the Debian OS on my Dragon Board 410C and I am into the graphical user interface now what I want to do is to use this Dragon Board as a headless server so which means I won't be using the GUI bit that means I can save on a lot of CPU, GPU and memory resources by disabling the graphical user interface all together so to do that first we will take a look at what kind of memory usage we are at this is a freshly booted up build of uh, Debian so you can go cat proc and mem info and scroll a bit up so the memory available is around 600 megabytes uh, this is what we will be looking at and uh, let's go ahead and disable our graphical user interface and so that we just boot into command line and then we will see uh, how is the memory looking so what we need to do is sudo if you are uh, logged in as Linaro user or any other user if you're logged in as root you can skip the sudo bit so sudo and system control uh, set dash default and multi user dot target so multi dash user dot target and that should have us boot into uh, only command line and not start up the GUI bit so let's go ahead and reboot so sudo reboot and there we go we are at login so I can log in at Linaro and password remains the same and there we go uh, and now we can look at our memory usage so now you can see that our available memory right here has grown from 600 megabytes to 800 megabytes so we have freed around 200 megabytes and that's a whole lot so now what if you want to go back and use 96 boards with a graphical user interface we are not uninstalling the whole GUI we are just temporarily disabling it so that right now we can go ahead and enable it back again so we can go back to here this is our previous command that we used and just remove the multi user dot target and put in graphical graphical dot target so and now this enables our GUI so now if I reboot or sudo reboot because you are not root uh, and and there you have it we have booted into the graphical user interface and again if you look at our our memory uh, situation and we can see that we are at around 600 or in this case a little bit less around 600 megabytes free uh, so thank you so much for watching uh, we will have more of these simple small guides and a bit more complex ones coming in the in the next few days weeks and months and we and don't forget to join us for our open hours live stream every Thursday 4 p.m. UTC. Thanks for watching.